The last elements needed for discharge include a disposition, such as home or transfer to the hospital, condition at discharge, and follow-up. If the patient is being transferred to a hospital, uh, no follow-up is required, so you can check the box uh, the, uh, for no follow-up. However, if, if the patient's uh, going home or uh, any other uh, type of discharge is not a transfer, uh, specific follow-up is highly recommended. Uh, you can click the Add Follow-up button. You can select the specialty that you desire, and then click the physician that you would like to send the patient to. You can give a specific date or a general time frame in which to follow up. Once disposition, discharge condition, and follow-up, as well as a diagnosis and additional instructions have all been provided to the patient, the patient can be marked ready for discharge. This will notify the nurse that the patient is uh, ready to leave the department. You can also print the instructions uh, to hand to the patient. Uh, this will give a, a uh, paper copy of the information uh, about the diagnosis and additional instructions for that patient. Clicking Ready for Discharge will tell you if there are missing items within the workup. And if you are ready to sign off on the chart, uh, you can make sure the finalized check box is clicked and then hit Approve. This will close the chart and lock it so that no further edits can be made uh, unless they're an addendum. If you would like to go back and add additional information later, you can uncheck the finalized box and this will leave the chart open for continued documentation at that time.